<laughs> Welcome back here to What's Real. I'm really excited to get started on our first slam dance film of the day. It's called Lost Holiday, and I have the directors, filmmakers, as well as the actors here, Thomas, Michael, and Kate. How are you three doing today? Hey, thanks hey, for having us. Absolutely, my pleasure. Thank you. And I'm going to get up and shake your hand. Thank How's you it going? So much. Absolutely, my Good. pleasure. You guys just got in, is that right? Kind of like last night. So this is kind of your first yeah. experience of, uh, of how everything's going on. So how is it? Oof, just getting rolling, yeah. I mean, we're we're so excited. It's our first uh, festival. To, we're, it's our world premiere, so we're like really excited to share it with audiences. Uh, congratulations, by the way. I got to take a look at the little clip that you guys sent, and it was hilarious. I was cracking up. I watched it like three times last night. Uh, tell me a little bit about the premise of the film. How did you get the idea? Oh, thanks. Well, uh, Lost Holiday is a uh, kind of a dark mystery buddy comedy about a bunch of friends who are uh, home for Christmas break in D.C and they were so not ready to turn 30. And uh, rather than facing the uh, existential dread of their lives, they decided to try to solve a local kidnapping and get in way over their heads. What can we distract ourselves with to avoid this 30-year-old <laughs> exactly. thing, what right? Could exactly. yeah, what, yeah, could what, could what could go wrong? Yeah, what could go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? And from what I understand, this film is kind of inspired by people that you know in your actual lives. And I, and I know that maybe the intersections in the film aren't exactly what have, had happened, but the question you guys kind of asked yourself as, as filmmakers was, what happens if all these crazy characters we've met throughout our lives kind of met one day? How would, how would that look, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. the, the initial relationship was actually based on Thomas and a good friend of his. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we thought it was a unique relationship because they are very good friends, male, female. Um, but the also the, the twist of the situation is also that um, they are uh, it's a reverse power dynamic. So okay. it's kind of like the, um, yeah, kind of like the uh, the original Thin Man series, the Nick and Nora okay. uh, detective couple who are kind of like cracking jokes and partying a little bit along the way and getting into a lot of trouble. And getting some hijinks along yeah, the way. Yeah, exactly. Uh, lots so, of hijinks. And Kate, tell me a little bit about your part. How, how was it playing your role? Sure. I play Margaret, who is Thomas's friend in the film, the Nora to his Nick. Um, oh, Nick to his Nora. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, like. These two have said we come home for the holiday and it's difficult to process how our friends have changed or not changed and how you're supposed to slot yourself back into a life that doesn't feel like yours anymore and where are you going with your life in the first place. And then uh, we sort of stumble uh, on a drunken night upon <laughs> a local kidnapping and misguidedly funnel all of our energy into that. So it was. You know, it was fun. It was, yeah, it was a really, lot of hijinks yeah. as a way of avoiding the banality of our own lives. I was going to say, how was it like playing this role in acting? It seemed like it was kind of a lot of fun. Like you had a lot of room to kind of play around and, and joke around with each other. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it, I mean, the script was also so tight and so um, punchy, kind of, that it was, it was really fun to play. And acting against Thomas was great, you know? Yeah. <laughs> we got it, bud. Well, look, uh, we wanted to create this dynamic that they've uh, been friends since they were like, 10 years old. Right. And so Kate came a couple days uh, before and we uh, we kind of played around. We drove all over the city to kind of like uh, get it, get into character and try to find that kind of dynamic, the way that they bounce off of each other. Well, it looks great. From the clip that I saw, it, it really does. It comes off like you guys are childhood friends that have kind of grown up together and stuff like that. So it's Good. really great. Thank you. Where, where can people see the film? When is it premiering? We're opening tonight at yeah. uh, Slam Dance in Park City and then we're going directly to Rotterdam wow. in the Netherlands for, uh, for to see what the... Uh, the audience is there, the how, audience they, how they receive it. That's kind of, amazing. Well, congratulations, guys. Uh, you guys are, are doing a really great job. I'm excited to see what you guys have in the future as well. Where can people go to keep up to date with any projects that you guys are working on? Do you, do you guys have social well, media or a website or anything like that? Oh, we're terrible at that. We need to, we need to learn how to do that yeah, stuff. We do have a Facebook page for okay. the film. Perfect. Um, so I think that we're trying to, you know, this is our world premiere today, so we're trying to get all everyone's eyeballs onto this film. Definitely to go see it at the theater at 5.15 today, and hopefully Wednesday yeah. it's going to replay. Excellent. At 8, right? Right, on Wednesday. Sounds good. Well, thank you guys so much for thank coming in for and talking us. about your film. It's an absolute thank pleasure. You. Welcome here to Park City, thank and I hope you guys enjoy your uh, stay and your festival visit. It seems like you guys will have a great time. Be sure and go check out Lost Holiday today at 5.15 at the Ballroom at Treasure Mountain. It's most likely going to replay tomorrow, or on Wednesday, pardon me, as mm -hmm. well. So check that out if you can't make it tomorrow or today, pardon me, uh, at the Treasure <laughs> Mountain Ballroom. We'll be right back with much, much more on What's Real.